All right, so let's continue making our minions. So we get these these edges, extrude them, and we keep extruding. Uh, I'll stretch them to make them straight and follow the head shape going around on the right view. So at this point, you match the lines in front and the ones in the back uh, so that they meet. Okay, I'll just tweak some of these points. Okay, so the, this last line is not following the reference very well, so I'll get this and I'll move it up on the back view. And the ones at the back, I'll use the top view, move them backwards. Well, look on the right view. I'll have to move them down a bit. Okay, that looks good. Alright, so I'll get this edge and start following the back view. Alright, so now it's to fill into the gaps. So what I'll be doing is extruding and then welding. I grab two points, control W and weld. Change this into texture wired so that you can see what you're doing. Tweaking is very important at this point. We continue filling into the gaps. Creating this character just reminds me of um, a character I used to watch when I was very young. Uh, Foster's uh, imaginary... What, what's it called again? Something, something. There was a character called Blue. He was in this, uh, this type of a shape. And as a kid, I actually thought he was very cool. I don't know. Maybe he is cool. I think I should get that show and watch it again. I don't know. Okay, so filling in at the back, uh, actually I tried to do a shortcut which didn't work out very well. Undo, I removed everything and well, you need those polygons so I just have to move them out. And weld these. So now to fill into this gap. Okay, so now we've got a uh, three face polygon. For this character, I think it's okay. So I've actually made, uh, it's no longer a polygon anyway, it's a triangle. So, so thank you for watching and see you in my next video which is on the screen right now so you can click on it. Uh, remember to like, subscribe and bye bye.